Hello guys, welcome back to the Harvest and Info Snow. Today I'm going to tell you and show you a quick gaming test on your Oppo Find X9 Pro and some performance tricks. So actually, this issue is very easy to the performance tricks are easy to do. The first thing is that we can go to the settings and scroll all the way down to the about phone set about the device section. Here in about device, scroll down. To RAM, tap it, and here enable the RAM expansion. When enabled, you have to uh, do nothing, but when disabled, tap this switch over here and you'll be prompted to restart your phone. As you can see here, you have now um, 20 gigabytes, almost, I mean, more than 20 because 28 gigabytes of RAM, which is actually a very nice amount, and it's abnormal of actually 40 pounds, so this is very, very good. And here, now, move this switch to the 12 gigabytes. Uh, what it does, it eats your storage and converts it to the RAM. And as you can see here, they have the system detects idle background apps and compresses the RAM data to free up space. That's how it works. Now we can go back and scroll down, still in the about device to version. Here, tap on the version number until you see here the label, you are a developer. It will be something about seven clicks, I think. Now go to the system and update, and here tap developer options. Here in the memory you should see this um, RAM extension that uh, you do have plus 4 gigabytes. And if you do, scroll down to drawing. It's right here, wait a moment, here, drawing. And here what I do recommend doing is tapping on each animation scale and either turn it off or just as you can see um top point point five because what it does actually it's uh either uh, as you can see removing the amount of animations or removing them at all as you can see now our phone is out of quicker it feels quicker but it's just about the animations so if you do like it uh off Turn and turn it off. If you don't like it, time, five, time, point 0.5, do it point 0.5. And actually, this is very nice for our phone to speed up the performance. As you can see here, if we do scroll a little bit down here, we have hardware accept rendering. This is not actually for us. It's because here is rendering and we don't really have to enable that. But here we have one single option in force for x msaa enable for x msaa in opengl es2 applications here uh, you can enable that because it's useful for games but it won't give you the much difference but if you want you can enable this option and actually uh, that's it for the all um, tricks about performance but about the uh, but we do have only one thing in the battery yeah here tap high performance mode and now it will it will increase the battery consumption but now we do have the best performance that we ever could now we can move to the PUBG gaming now as you can see we are in the PUBG and as for the lobby itself the main menu it as you can see is very smooth as you can see without any likes we can uh, claim the rewards or something like that but let's start the match and see you during the match as you can see let me move this bus from here we are in the game itself and as for the performance it's quite good as you can see here they have 60 fps and without any likes when he, without any shutters without actually anything uh, even shooting at us, it's, uh, it's smooth, <laughs> so I can't say that it's bad. The match starts in 10 seconds, but as I can see now, we don't have any um, bad, um, very bad performance. As for the battery, uh, we, I, do play for the, I do play this game in one minute or two minutes, and I do have this game enabled, and not 1% and go off the battery, went off the battery.
here when the game started we do have do we do see that even here the performance is very nice we do have stable 60 fps let's see what will be happening in the city as you can see i'm here and what can i see that we do have no loss of the performance at all we do have i mean maybe it's less smooth but i think that it's almost 60 fps it's near 60 fps so yeah actually i really like it it's very very nice and smooth <clears throat> as for the price of this phone it's very very nice actually and cool so yeah and what about the heat uh i don't feel the heat at all during at the moment so yes mm, that's how it works and uh, yeah i don't know how you can see it on the camera but i do feel this game very smooth i mean i do get i mean now 50 to 60 fps i don't have the performance as i can see uh performance and in fps in fps here anywhere but i can feel that because i play games a lot but not on the phones but i do and you can feel that actually even when your phone is 144 hertz you can feel that as i can see here we do wait a moment we do have it here in the graphics that here we do have we can tap for example better graphics but here we have download it so let's not do it now as i can see the game feels very very smooth actually very very nice but now let's do it on the ultra graphics So now let me show you what I do change. Let me not first zoom it in for you. And now as I can see, here we have better graphics, Ultra HDR, Ultra HDR, style movie, color mode normal, normal, brightness 150, non-star screens, as I can see, and leave it default by default. Now here we can tap apply and let's see now in the gameplay itself. So now, actually, I've jumped out of the plane and we are flying to the Penguin City, as you can see. And I'm actually very impressed because the <laughs> graphics are set to the better graphics and we do have Ultra HDRs everywhere. And as I can see now, we do have the great performance. I don't really think that we have lost any FPS comparing to the mm, uh, normal customized options that were normal. And as I can see, the game looks, and the game looks actually um, not maybe out, not out better, but it looks better. Not, this is a noticeable difference. But let's see what will be happening over there. So as I can see, um, the performance is very nice as for the beginning of the game, and I don't really think that it will be uh, much worse after the everything actually after the game, etc. As for the battery, here as I can see in actually 15 minutes, we do have 2% um, loss. So not, it's not that not, not bad actually, because one uh, PUBG uh, match is almost 30 minutes, I think, for the maybe uh, maximum. Maybe 20 minutes even. So yeah, I think you can play a lot of different <laughs> all of different um, games during the uh, during the one single charge as you can see i'm down but as for the performance it's very very nice i don't really think that we do have any um, we do have here any uh, performance loss compared to the previous section previous actually graphic section let me, for example, fly now to the different location. For example, let me fly over here. As for the PUBG, I really think that this is a very, very great idea to play on this phone, actually. This is not uh, advert advertised as a gaming phone, but as you can see, I didn't fly to the... <laughs> but, as a, but as you can see, it feels just very, very nice and very, very clear. And as for the um, heat, 
What about the heat? I don't really feel the heat. I mean, heat is building somewhere here near the chip, of course, build the camera. But here, the battery, it stayed cool as for it now. So I think that Oppo did great in this phone. But we'll see what the Ultra brings to us in a, a couple of weeks. But as you can see, that's it for the PUBG. It just feels very, very nice. As for the battery, we have now 63%. So uh, one, once again, 1% one per, one loss. I don't really think that we should notice a big difference because this CPU in this phone is very, very great. Just as you can see, see yourself. It doesn't have any lags, nothing. Here they have a lot of things. We can zoom in to the map, zoom out from the map, <clears throat> do everything. But let's move to the another game. This is not maybe a great, um, a great um, example of the game that's very powerful to our phone. But I switched from the PUBG almost in a moment to the Brawl Stars, and um, it's as you can see very very nice and smooth. So yeah, I really I really think that this this is very very nice actually. So yeah, and as for the Brawl Stars here, I don't really think that we have something to discuss here. It just feels very very nice. It's very very nice and. Yeah, so overall with with here with this in a moment with the settings about the great performance and uh, animations, it just feels very, very nice. And summing this all up and coming to the conclusion, I really think that the phone that the phone feels very, very nice while, while gaming and I can really recommend doing this. But as for the heat, let me tell you something about the heat. I don't know why, but in a moment, actually, the heat build up uh, uh, here and maybe not that much, but the frame actually feels uh, warmer and here this place is warm. I don't know why, but I mean, I know why, because here we have the CPU, uh, the processor main uh, thing of the phone, the brain of the phone, but I don't know why it came that hot in just a couple of minutes. And that's it. Hope it helps. Have a nice day. Goodbye.